<laughs> you probably can't see me but welcome to Penny Pass now you know last week I was easily led out onto the water when it's cold well this week it's happened again but this time we're climbing Snowdon for sunrise alright guys <laughs> You're not going to be able to see much for a bit, but we'll see what happens. Let's go. So sit ref, we've got about halfway off and I've got a bit of a cold so I'm going to call it because chest feels slightly tight and I don't want to risk it, I don't want to risk getting ill up on the mountain. Dan and Amy have carried on because I'm pretty safe where I am so I've told them to carry on and I'm just going to take my time on the way back and probably do a bit of photography to be honest and enjoy the view. I wish I could go up there, but uh, it's not the right time, it's not the right time. I may have done it twice this year, so it's not too bad, not too bad. This place is awesome, I wish I could show you more of it. But sun's up in about hour and half, three quarters. Hopefully we'll see something then. Dan's going to get some footage up there. Yeah. Shattered. <laughs> Lack of sleep doesn't help. But that's a valuable lesson to anybody. Don't worry about failing. You can always do it again. It is disappointing at the time, but sometimes it's just the best way. Always keep yourself safe. That's the main thing. Anyway. Go down. See a bad lake. Check this out. Not far from the car park now, and uh, there's a few guys that are going past here and there, not many. But it's so quiet, so peaceful. It's worth just coming just to visit the two lakes, to be fair. This is the miners' track, if I haven't already said. And the uh, scenery is beautiful. To get to the two lakes, it's a relatively easy walk. A little bit of uphill, but not too bad. But... Uh, it's gorgeous. We're about half an hour or so from sunrise. And uh, yeah, I would say Dan and Amy are pretty close to the summit now. Let's see what the footage is here. See you back at the car. 